I'm so glad you came. It's an honor, really. There's so much for us to discuss. What do you want? I'd like to propose an alliance. I think the two of us could accomplish great things together. I don't work with criminals. You need to turn yourself in. Tell you what. I'll turn myself in as soon as you do the same. But you don't consider yourself a criminal, do you? The suit, the gadgets, the sense of entitlement. You're just another rich kid atoning for his fiscal sins. Such a shame. You're either with us or against us! Kid. So, what does it matter? I wanted to make a difference. I thought you'd feel the same. I do, but not like this. A lot of innocent people almost died tonight because of you. Innocent? They watched as Gotham went to hell and didn't do a thing! They're just afraid. No, they're weak! And so are you. The police are on their way. You ever wonder how things got to be so bad here? I do. All the time. See, I don't think men like Roman Sionis or Oswald Cobblepot are responsible. They're just a reflection of our apathy, our greed, our fear. We look the other way when things turn sour, bury ourselves in our jobs, consume propaganda masquerading as entertainment. The message is always the same. Don't think. Don't question. 
And what becomes of a society that's given up? It rots. Fills up with liars, cheaters, and thugs. Uptown and downtown. The suit in the penthouse is no better than the guy selling drugs in the corner. They're both doing whatever it takes to get ahead. Never mind the cost. Fidelity. Once upon a time, that's what defines society. People coming together in pursuit of common cause. To care for each other. To protect and provide. We took shelter from the darkness and the things that roamed it. Community meant progress. But now, it's all backwards. We worship at the altar of competition. We build fortresses around ourselves. We fight, we betray. We have become the things we feared. You keep cleaning up after everyone, Batman, and no one's going to learn to take care of themselves. The ones that don't hate you, they'll start to rely on you, depend on you. And if something happens to you, if you get old or bored or die, then what? Or do you not consider the world that revolves around you? You're a hypocrite, running around dispensing justice, telling people what they can and can't do. You're ensuring Gotham's freedom, provided it conforms to your twisted view. Whatever pleases the bad, that it? You're not a hero. You're a despot. You don't enforce justice. You suppress it. There's a way to make this work. To show you that we share the same goals. Maybe I took things too far with the bombs and the threats. I, I can learn from that. I mean, you could be a mentor to me. And maybe, well, maybe I can teach you something too. Because I think you're so busy playing a hero, you've forgotten what it's like for the rest of us. We're not all as strong as you. We don't have the fancy gadgets, the, the strength, the skill. But, but, but maybe that's the problem. You've gotten so used to the power, you think you're better than everyone. Above reproach. Is that it then? We're not as good as you? You know what? I take it back. I don't want to work with you. You don't have anything to offer. I think I figured it out. You didn't take me down because I broke the law. No. No, no, no. You took me down because you don't want the competition. That's what this is really about, isn't it? Let me ask you something. You ever wonder if you're the reason the city's so messed up? Because I have. A lot of us have. And I'm starting to think we're right.